Hi guys, I'm Nina back Iverson. I'm here with the red carpet report at the Beverly Wheelchair where AARP, the magazine, today are celebrating the 14th annual Movies for Grown Up Award Gala. How are you tonight, first of all? I have to ask you. Uh, I'm kind of great. Life's good. It's a good season to be uh, an actor. It's all celebrating everything that's brilliant about our business. And, um, and I'm over 50, so I'm in the right place. <laughs> what was your favorite movie of 2014? Well, uh, there's a lot of them. I want to tell you, um, yikes. I'll tell you, my best foreign film was Wild Tales. If you get a chance to see that, it is spectacular. It's from Argentina and Spain. It's, I've seen it three times. I just freaking loved it. Um, as far as American films, I love Sniper, and I absolutely loved Whiplash. As far as the English films, I have to go with like the, the two top ones. I mean, the theory of everything was genius, just genius. And so was the, the what was it, the numbers game? What was it called? The uh, the one with uh, Cumberbatch. What's the name? Um, it's just slipped my mind. That's another senior moment. I'm having a senior moment here. <laughs> this and, is uh, what we are here for. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it was a brilliant movie also. True story. The, what? Are you think, thinking about the imitation game? That's it, the imitation yeah. game. There it is. And, Thank you. Uh, I mean, we are from Norway. So the movie is directed by a Norwegian man, and he's brilliant. nominated. Yeah brilliant and, and uh, what has he done before because he's just that uh, that movie was amazing he did headhunters in Norway which was a huge film uh, but this is his first like big breakthrough in America do you think he did a good job I think he did a brilliant job and please hire me for your next one I'm available and it is award season so I have to ask you what is your favorite part about these red carpets and the galas and everything Wow, the favorite part is when it's finally over. I put these guys go through it, man. They go, they go through it for weeks, and it's a lot of stress. So when it's over, it's a big sigh. Right? Okay, I won or I lost, but at the same time, they're all winners. Once you're nominated, I mean, it's one of the greatest things that you can imagine. Are they all playing the same part? No. So how can you really judge who's better, who who affected you more? You can get. Oh my God, it was the role, the role, and how they did it, but. That kind of, kind of stuff drives me crazy. But uh, when it's all over and said and done, so I guess that's, my favorite part is this part, is, is like congratulations on your nomination. And God, you were great this year and so was everybody else. And you know when they stand up and there's all the lights are on them, all the high beams are on you, like, oh my God. But you thank everybody for their brilliant work for the, throughout the year. And that's one of, the, one of the great things we give back to each other as, as artists. And then, of course, there is the big after parties. So I have to ask you, what's your favorite after party moment? Do you have any memories from a crazy after party? Uh, that's a really good thing. Yes, I sat down once at the the, the, the party of parties, as it were, um, and I'm sitting there next to. Um, oh my God! It was it was amazing. I was sitting next to. If I can remember who sat next to us, it was amazing. But anyway, they all came to see her. I was with like I was like Stella Adler or something. This was years ago. But everybody came to pay homage. No, I know who it was now. Scratch that. Roll it back. I was sitting with Ellen Burson, who was nominated for Wrecking for a Dream, which I was in the Darren Aronofsky film. And it was amazing. So I make sure, you know, she got a table. And when we had a table, everybody that came by was like done it again Ellen unbelievable it's like her 19th well no maybe her ninth um, nomination she was brilliant I did a lot of scenes with her it was fun and it was great meeting everybody who came by I had to play with Tom Hanks in New York a year ago and I met everybody in New York because here's his dressing room and here's my dressing room right next to it so they all came by us and I stick my head and go oh Meryl Streep again come on Meryl you've seen it already you came back, you big lughead. So it was great. I mean, I mean, pictures with Bruce Springsteen and Sting, and I mean, it was crazy fun. A lot of crazy nights. Yeah, good nights. Yeah, it's fun. Well, congratulations with everything, and thank you so much. Thank you so much. Nice thank you. Nice to meet you. That's all we got from the red carpet here today for the red carpet report. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel because a lot more of celebrity interviews and red carpets are coming up. Share the video and also leave us a comment because we want to know what's your favorite movie from 2014. And do you have any Oscar favorites? So leave a comment, share the video, and don't forget to subscribe.